Welcome to the Accu Web Hosting Video Tutorial. Today, we will guide you on how to automatically block brute force attacker's IP on a Windows server. If you want a PDF file of this video tutorial, you can download it from our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting. We have mentioned our Telegram channel link in the description. Kindly click on the link and find the PDF file of this video tutorial. Before we begin, take a look at AccuWebHosting.com to review various hosting services offered by us. You can contact us through chat, phone, or send us an email at sales at AccuWebHosting.com. Let's begin the tutorial. Brute force attacks are one of the most common types of cyber attacks. In a brute force attack, attackers try to gain access to a system by repeatedly guessing usernames and passwords until they find the correct combination. These attacks can be very damaging, as they can give attackers access to sensitive data and systems. One way to prevent brute force attacks is to automatically block the IP addresses of attackers. This video tutorial will demonstrate how to automatically block the IP addresses of brute force attackers on a Windows server. We will achieve this by installing the IP band tool, which will automatically block the IP addresses of attackers. What is IP ban and how it works? IP ban is an open source software tool that is used to block IP addresses of potential attackers or malicious users from accessing a computer or network. It is designed to work with a variety of operating systems, including Windows and Linux. IP ban works by monitoring log files for suspicious activity, such as failed login attempts. When it detects such activity, it blocks the IP address associated with the activity, preventing further access from that IP address. IP ban uses a range of techniques to determine which IP addresses to block. For example, it can analyze log files to identify repeated failed login attempts or requests from IP addresses that are known to be associated with malicious activity. Let's see the requirements of IP ban. IP ban is a versatile software tool that can be used on various operating systems, including Windows servers. To install and use IP ban on a Windows server, you will need to ensure that your system meets the following requirements. Operating system IP ban supports Windows Server 2012, Windows Server 2016, and Windows Server 2019 OS. .NET Framework IP ban requires the .NET Framework 4.7.2 or later to be installed on your system. PowerShell PowerShell 5.1 or greater is required to install IP ban. Administrative privileges You will need administrative privileges to install and configure IP ban on your Windows server. Firewall to use IP ban, the firewall must be enabled on the Windows server. By ensuring that your system meets these requirements, you can install and use IP ban to automatically block the IP addresses of potential attackers and protect your system from cyber attacks. Let's see how to install IP ban on the Windows server. Step 1. Connect to your Windows server using remote desktop connection. Firstly, you need to establish a remote desktop connection to your Windows server. To do this, launch the remote desktop connection application on your local machine. Enter the IP address or hostname of your server, and click the connect button. Enter the credentials for the remote server, and you should be logged in.
We have successfully logged into the server. Step 2. Visit the IP BAN GitHub repository. Visit the official IP BAN GitHub repository at https colon slash slash github.com slash digitalruby slash IP BAN. Once you're there, look for the Windows installation command that you need to run in PowerShell to install IPBAN on your server. Step 3. Open PowerShell on the server. Once you're logged in, open PowerShell on the server. To do this, click on the Start menu and search for PowerShell. Right-click on Windows PowerShell and select Run as Administrator from the context menu. This will launch PowerShell with administrative privileges. It's important to note that PowerShell 5.1 or greater is required to install IPBAN. If you don't have PowerShell 5.1 or a greater version installed, you need to update it before proceeding with the installation. You can check the PowerShell version by running the command $ps version table. Step 4. Paste the IP ban installation command in PowerShell. With the IP ban installation command copied, go back to the PowerShell window, paste the command, and hit enter to run the command. The installation process will begin, and you should see progress messages as IP ban is installed on the server. Once the installation is complete, you will see a success message indicating that IPBAN has been installed on your server. Congratulations! You have successfully installed IP ban on your Windows server. Let's explore the process of checking an IP address that has been blocked by IP ban. Once the IP ban installation is completed, you need to open the firewall on your server. You can do this by going to the control panel and clicking on the system and security and then click on Windows Firewall option. In the Firewall window, click on the Advanced Settings option. This will open the Windows Defender Firewall with Advanced Security window. Here, you need to click on the Inbound Rules option on the left-hand side of the window. Now, find the IP ban rule in the list of inbound rules. Once you find the IP ban rule, right-click on it and select the Properties option from the context menu. This will open the Properties window for the IP ban rule. In the IP ban rule properties window, navigate to the Scope tab. Here, you will see the list of IPs that have been blocked by the IP ban tool.
let's quickly sum up the context of this video. We saw how to automatically block brute force attackers IP on a Windows server. Hope this video will be helpful for you. If you like our technical videos, please press the subscribe button and bell icon to receive instant notification of our new videos. Each like is important to us so do not forget to symbol us. To download a PDF file of this video, please subscribe to our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting, where you will have access to the PDF files of all our videos. Thank you for watching.